वेलकम टू वंडर स्लेट सब्सक्राइब टू आर टेलीग्राम चैनल गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन टू अपडेट्स एंड स्टडी मटेरियल्स टॉपिक फॉर टूडेज क्विज इज नाइनटीन ऑफ एप्रिल ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन करंट अफेयर्स पार्ट टू क्वेश्चन नंबर वन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग कंट्रीज लॉन्च इट्स फर्स्ट सैटेलाइट नेपाली सेट वन सक्सेसफुली ऑप्शन ए भूटान ऑप्शन बी युगेंडा ऑप्शन सी इंडोनेशिया ऑप्शन डी नेपाल द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी नेपाल द कंट्री ऑफ नेपाल रिसेंटली लॉन्च इट्स फर्स्ट सैटेलाइट नेपाली सेट वन सक्सेसफुली whose weight is just 1.3 kilograms and its cost is 2 crores this project was created by the scientific scientist abash and hari ram best of nepal under the birds project question number 2 recently the list of the 100 most influential people in the world has been released by whom option a unesco option b time magazine option c forbes magazine option d World Bank The correct answer is option B Time magazine recently the list of 100 most influential people in the world has been released by Time magazine where Reliance Industries chairman Mukesh Ambani and lawyer Arundhati Kachu and Meneka Guruswami have been ranked question number 3 The world's largest indoor waterfall has been opened to the public at which airport? Option A, Indira Gandhi International Airport, Delhi. Option B, Kochi Airport, Kerala. Option C, Changi Airport, Singapore. Option D, Dubai Airport, Dubai. The correct answer is Option C Changi Airport Singapore the world's largest indoor waterfall has been opened to the public in Changi Airport Singapore this indoor waterfall was being renewed for the last 4 years the swimming pool is also built on the roof of Changi Airport question number 4 in the case of 4G network availability which telecom company has left America Japan South Korea behind option A Bharti Airtel option B Reliance Jio option C Vodafone option D Idea The correct answer is option B Reliance Jio according to a report by Open Signal Mukesh Ambani's Reliance Jio has surpassed America Japan and South Korea in terms of 4G network availability the availability rate of Jio is 97.5% question number 5 which indian woman cricketer has been appointed the goodwill ambassador of the street child cricket world cup option a smriti mandhana option b mitali raj option c harmeet kaur option d jhulan goswami The correct answer is option B Mitali Raj Indian women cricketer and captain Mitali Raj has been appointed the goodwill ambassador of the street child cricket world cup question number 6 during the lok sabha election the former union minister has resigned from the rashtriya janata dal party option A Sandeep Sharma option B Emily Ashraf Fatmi option C विजय त्यागी ऑप्शन डी शशि थरूर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी एम अली अशरफ फातमी ड्यूरिंग द लोकसभा इलेक्शन द फॉर्मर यूनियन मिनिस्टर अली अशरफ फातमी हैज रिजाइन फ्रॉम द राष्ट्रीय जनता दल ही हैज ऑल्सो अनाउंस्ड हिज नॉमिनेशन फ्रॉम मधुबनी लोकसभा सीट ऑन एटीन अप्रैल Question number 7 Which e-commerce company has announced the closure of business in China since July 18th Option A Flipkart Option B Alibaba 
ऑप्शन सी एमेजॉन ऑप्शन डी वॉलमार्ट द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी एमेजॉन अकॉर्डिंग टू ब्लूमबर्ग रिपोर्ट द एमेजॉन कंपनी अनाउंस द क्लोजर ऑफ बिजनेस इन चाइना फ्रॉम जुलाई एटीन फ्रॉम नाउ ऑन एमेजॉन विल नॉट बी एबल टू प्रोवाइड सर्विसेज टू सेलर्स इन चाइना क्वेश्चन नंबर एट असद उमर हैज रिजाइंड एज द फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर ऑफ विच कंट्री ऑप्शन ए श्रीलंका ऑप्शन बी भूटान ऑप्शन सी जापान ऑप्शन डी पाकिस्तान द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी पाकिस्तान असद उमर हैज रिजाइंड एज द फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर ऑफ पाकिस्तान ड्यू टू कॉन्स्टेंट क्रिटिसिजम असद उमर हैज सेड दैट आई वॉज ऑफर्ड टू स्टेप डाउन एंड टेक चार्ज ऑफ द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एनर्जी क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन विच डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन अप्रिल नाइनटीन इन द वर्ल्ड ऑप्शन ए वर्ल्ड कैंसर डे ऑप्शन बी वर्ल्ड लिवर डे ऑप्शन सी वर्ल्ड टीबी डे ऑप्शन डी वर्ल्ड पोस्ट डे द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी वर्ल्ड लिवर डे वर्ल्ड लिवर डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन द नाइनटीन ऑफ एप्रिल ई टूडे द मेन पर्पज ऑफ दिस डे इज टू स्प्रेड अवेयरनेस अमंग द पीपल अबाउट डिजीज इज रिलेटेड टू लिवर क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन The US State Department has approved a possible agreement to train the F-16 pilots of which country? Option A, China. Option B, Australia. Option C, Taiwan. Option D, Japan. The correct answer is Option C, Taiwan. The US Foreign Ministry has recently approved a possible agreement to train Taiwanese F-16 pilots. At the same time, the US will launch a military training program of $500 million, about 3480 crore. Question number 11. The second phase of Lok Sabha elections 2019 will be held on April 18th, 2019 in how many constituencies? Option A, 84. Option B, ninety-seven. Option C, one hundred twenty-three. Option D, one hundred thirty-one. The correct answer is option B, ninety-seven. The second phase of Lok Sabha elections twenty nineteen will be held on April eighteenth, twenty nineteen, in ninety seven Lok Sabha constituencies across twelve states and one union territory. The voting for Lok Sabha elections twenty nineteen phase two will be held for some parliamentary constituencies of Assam, Bihar, Chhattisgarh, Jammu and Kashmir, Karnataka, Maharashtra, Manipur, Odisha, Tamil Nadu, Tripura, Uttar Pradesh. and west bengal question number 12 the election commission has cancelled polling in which among the following constituencies on grounds of misuse of money option a irod option b vellore option c salem option d perambalur the correct answer is option b Vellore the election commission of india has cancelled polling tamil in nadu's vellore constituency on the grounds of misuse of money the south indian state will go to polls for 38 out of the total 39 lok sabha seats on april 18th 2019 during the second phase of polls vellore polls have been rescinded following reports of the large scale illegal flow of cash question number 13 President Trump has vetoed a bill that sought an end to US military support for Saudi led war in this nation. Option A, Iran. Option B, Sudan. Option C, Yemen. Option D, Afghanistan. The correct answer is Option C, Yemen.
U.S. President Donald Trump on April 16, 2019 vetoed a bill passed by the Congress to end U.S. military assistance in Saudi Arabia-led war in Yemen. The veto, which is the second one in Trump's presidency, was expected. The Congress had voted for the first time to invoke the War Powers Resolution to try and stop U.S. involvement in a foreign conflict. Question number 14. One of the world's largest one-day elections began in which nation on April 17, 2019? Option A. India. Option B. Malaysia. Option C. Indonesia. Option D. Algeria. The correct answer is Option C. Indonesia. Indonesia on April 17, 2019 kicked off one of the world's biggest one-day elections to pick a new president and parliament after a six-month campaign. The polls have pitted incumbent President Joko Widodo, who is a clear favorite, against ex-General Prabowo Subianto in a race to lead the nation. Question number 15. Which among the following iconic structures almost burned down recently after a devastating blaze? Option A. Acropolis of Athens. Option B. Notre Dame Cathedral. Option C. Westminster Abbey. Option D. The Colosseum. The correct answer is Option B. Notre Dame Cathedral. The Notre Dame Cathedral in central Paris, France almost burned down in a devastating fire that began on April 15, 2019. The fire completely destroyed the spire of the iconic structure and two-thirds of its largely medieval roof. UNESCO experts have agreed to help in rebuilding the structure. Question number 16. Which nation has disarmed its police as terror threat level lowered? Option A. New Zealand. Option B. Australia. Option C. South Korea. Option D. Japan. The correct answer is Option A. New Zealand. New Zealand police on April 17, 2019 ended the routine arming of frontline officers as the terrorism threat level was lowered a month after the Christchurch mosque's massacre. The police and security agencies reduced the threat level from high to medium. The level is still higher than it was before the March 15 attacks, when the threat was deemed to be low. Question number 17. The Reserve Bank of India on April 17, 2019 issued banknotes signed by the Governor Shakti Kanta Das of which denomination? Option A. 20 rupees. Option B. 50 rupees. Option C. 100 rupees. Option D. 200 rupees. The correct answer is Option B. 50 rupees. The Reserve Bank of India, RBI, on April 17, 2019, issued 50 rupees denomination banknotes signed by the Governor Shakti Kanta Das. The design of these notes is similar in all respects to 50 rupee banknotes in Mahatma Gandhi new series. Question number 18. Which of the following platforms blocked the access to TikTok app recently in India? Option A. Facebook. Option B. Instagram. Option C. Google. Option D. Twitter. The correct answer is Option C. Google. Google on April 16, 2019 blocked the access to highly popular Chinese video app TikTok on its Play Store following the refusal of the Madras High Court to lift the ban imposed on the app on April 3, 2019. The app is now not available for download from Google Play Store. Question number 19. The world's largest airplane took off for the very first time on April 13, 2019. The aircraft has been developed by which company? Option A. Strata Launch. Option B. Boeing. Option C. Airbus. Option D. Lockheed Martin. The 
The correct answer is Option A. Strata Launch, world's largest airplane took off for the very first time on April 13, 2019. Strata Launch built this aircraft in eight years. After its successful test flight, company hopes to use the twin fuselage, six-engine, catamaran-style aircraft to launch satellite-bearing rockets into space by 2022. This test flight was done at Mojave Desert, California. Question number 20. A raging fire recently tore through Notre Dame Cathedral, the 850-year-old Gothic building. The cathedral is located in which country? Option A. France. Option B. Italy. Option C. Belgium. Option D. Hungary. The correct answer is Option A. France. In France, a raging fire tore through 850-year-old Gothic building, Notre Dame Cathedral in central Paris. Around 400 firefighters battled into the night to control the flames. The cause of the blaze was not immediately clear. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now. Link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.